we've had a chopping board made and as it's finally come through the thicknesser for final to final thickness we've uncovered this void that was obviously inside the timber now it's quite it's quite deep right down in there it goes quite a long way into the the wood probably a good three millimeters on a 22 millimeter board so don't really want to take it down thickness anymore so the idea is that we will attempt a bow tie of sorts um, I guess we could do any shape we really wanted but there seems to be quite a sort of following for the bow ties at the moment so we'll give it a whirl this is sort of 65 millimeters here and about 30 there which matches a piece of dark darker timber we have which I'll, I'll make the mail out of um, so we'll clock it up in the mill and we'll we'll give it a run I can't. That void just kept going and going and going. So I'm very glad we didn't run it through thickness. We had some minor. Not sure what happened here when the machine was cutting. Jumped in a little bit there and there. But we seem to have a pretty tight fit. Just have to the light sand down and hopefully we'll be able to just uh, glue it straight in. So the moment of truth, it's been under clamps for 24 hours. So now we're just finishing up the board with uh, a coat of mineral oil. I like to do one coat of plain mineral oil and then finish it up with a 4 to 1 ratio of oil to uh, beeswax, which I just buy locally. So overall I'm pretty happy how this came out. It could have been a disaster, but it's turned out to be a really nice jogging board. So uh, thanks for watching. If you enjoy it, click subscribe, leave a comment, hit the thumbs up. And uh, we'll see you again next time. Thank you.